So say you want to have $500,000 in a savings annuity when you retire in 35 years. If this account earns 5% interest, how much should you deposit each month to reach your retirement goal? So it's the same formula that we've used before for savings annuities. The difference now is that we're given the lump sum that we want to have at the end. In other words, we're given F, then we're asked to find the deposit amount, P. So, just like before, we'll fill in all the pieces that we know. So F is 500,000. P is unknown, that's what we're going to find. All the other pieces that were given. R is 0 0.05, the 5% interest. N is 12, because we're making deposits monthly. And T is 35, because we want to retire 35 years from now. To solve for P, what we'll do is figure out what everything in brackets equals. We'll simplify that down. Divide that by 0 0.05 divided by 12. And then we'll have P times everything else as a single number equals 500,000. Then we'll divide 500,000 by that single number and we'll have P, the regular deposit amount. So on the calculator, I'll start with the innermost parentheses again. 1 plus 0 0.05 divided by 12 raise that answer to the power of 12 times 35, subtract 1, and that represents everything in brackets. Now if I divide this by r over n, 0 0.05 divided by 12, that number is everything that's multiplied by p to get to 500,000. So if I divide 500,000, by this answer, I'll get P. And so P, the regular deposit amount, is $440.11. What that means is if I deposit $440 every month for the next 35 years, I can expect to have half a million dollars in this account when I retire.